So we're here with uh, the star Deontay Christmas from Temple University, that everyone's famously known for. Um, are you a second or a junior? No, no, no. Just okay, no, so no, you want to no, talk no. to us a little bit about your father? I know you got a lot of history and background from your father, a lot of respect from him, what yeah. he did. Um, man, just growing up, man, he was a guy that, um, you know, was always there for me. Um, got me into basketball. Um, always just been a great mentor, man. Somebody I looked up to all my life. Um, you know, he never missed a, I met, never missed a game since I was uh, 10 years old. Mm -hmm. He was my coach when I was young. Um, actually, he was one of the first guys to ever bench me. So that, <laughs> that actually uh, just drove me to right, be right. You know, the guy I am today. But uh, much respect for him. If it wasn't for my dad, man, I wouldn't be here today. Nice, nice. So, so talk to us a little bit about your career in Temple, how that was and you know, type of experience. Oh, man, that was crazy, crazy experience, man. Went in, um, you know, freshman year, mm -hmm. didn't play much, average about – 11 minutes a game, probably scored all of, all of eight points the whole year. Mm -hmm. um, that was that was John Chambers last year. Okay. Then I uh, trans, transformed into uh, with uh, Fran Duffy. He came in and uh, basically he gave everybody a clean slate. He mm -hmm. said, I'm not going off of last year's stats or anybody. I want you guys to go out and, and show me what you can do. And, uh, you know, that summer, man, I worked real hard. And I came in my sophomore year and I played really well. And, uh, you know, fast forward things, I ended up leading Atlanta Tennis scoring. That was a 20 a game. And, um, I, I didn't look back since. My junior year came in again, worked real hard in my sophomore year in the summer. Came in, led the Atlanta Tennis scoring again, uh, so on, so forth and so forth. And I did the same thing my senior year and uh, ended up being like one of the first guys to ever lead the Atlanta Tennis in three years straight. And I scored 2,000 points in three years. So great, great. it was crazy. Great. So uh, I know a lot of people, they know about your NBA career. Yeah. Uh, you've been fighting, battling, in and out and everything. So give us a little update on how that was. Uh, you right now. First of all, man, Guys, I like to think, you know, for me getting there, you know, uh, coming out of, uh, from overseas, man, uh, you know, I didn't get drafted to come out of Temple. Mm -hmm. Everybody know that. And, you know, people just saying that there's a lot of things that I couldn't do to make it. Mm -hmm. And, um, you know, every year I just try to add something new to my game. You know as well, man, you've right. been having battles since right, right. I was 18, 19 years old. Right, right, right. You know, even you was telling me things like, oh, you need to go to the hole more, play defense more, get strong, things like that. Right. And I just took that in from everybody, not just from pro guys, just everybody I played against. Mm -hmm. And uh, one summer, man, I made a phone call to a guy named Chuck Ellis, as y'all know. You know, rest in peace to late great John Harnett. You know, he, he died, and uh, that was my workout guy. But uh, when he died, I just needed somebody to help me continue my growth. Mm -hmm. And Chuck Ellis was that guy, man. We just lo locked ourselves in the gym for a whole summer. Mm -hmm. And I finally got my chance with Boston Celtics. I made it. Mm -hmm. And uh, unfortunately, I got I got waived through the middle of the year. I was there like three months. Mm -hmm. And then, you know, I knew I was, was that close. Right. And the following year, me and Chuck did the same thing. And I ended up making the team for Phoenix Suns, and I, I stuck for the whole year, man. So that right there was a dream come true. True, it's just a testament to my hard work and everybody that helped me to where I, I got to that day. Man. It, was just a, it was a blessing. Man. Right, right, right. That was good stuff to see. Now, I personally was proud of you. Um, it's glad to hear you talk on that. Yeah. Um, you want to update us on the, the current situation? Yeah. yeah. Um, the last year. Um, I was with, uh, well, Philly assigned me, and they assigned me to the Delaware 87ers. And unfortunately, I got an injury in uh, February, beginning of February, I tore my Achilles. And now that's why I'm here. <laughs> with the grace of you, let right. me play in your league. Uh, right. I've been playing at Linfest, Myers, just trying to get my you know, my, my, my rhythm back. Right. You know, I've been back for about a, like four or five weeks. Right now, I just got cleared 100%. You know, and I'm feeling real good. I think a couple more weeks, man, I'll be at a, you know, in, in, in game shape. But uh, right. thanks to y'all guys, man, for letting me play in the alumni league. Right. You know, we are, I got an 0-2 start right now, right. but that's going to pick up. <laughs> right. uh, man, I just thank y'all and all the guys in the city, man, just been giving me rent and giving me money. Uh, just giving me some money, man, and help me get back to running. All right, well, before we let you go and finish working on your game, not, uh, tell us a little bit about what your thoughts about the alumni league. Oh, man, it's great, man. I, there's some of these guys that I haven't seen since high school. Man. Right, like, right, right. I just played against Tracy Royal. I haven't seen him in, like, Years, right, you know, right. uh, fatty, and mm -hmm. the mansion team is great. Right. Played against Penwood, Germantown team. I see Central got a lot of guys, Street Bray, Scott Rogers. Right, right, right. So like, uh, I'm, I'm looking at Bach. I'm seeing those guys from back right, when I played right. in high school. So, right, right. man, it's a great league, man. It's, it's, it's good that you put this together because guys like, um, you know, in times like this, I'm not, I haven't been home a lot, but I'm, I'm sure there's not a lot of places that we can turn to right, to right, play right, basketball. Right, and even right. guys like myself, Scott Rogers, which is still a, a pro, obviously. Mm -hmm. Uh, the guys at home at this time, they can come and get some rent, man. Right, right, y'all guys don't uh, tell us, oh, no, I can't play y'all pros. Y'all invite them. Y'all right, invite right, them, man. Right. So that's the right. thing I love about Philly. Love about Philly guys, playing against Philly guys, man. So it just, uh, just want to say thank y'all. Thank you, and everybody. Just, uh, just allow me to play. Uh, well, great, man. We want to thank you, too, for, for coming sure, out. For sure, for sure. And I'll leave, man. For Appreciate sure. you. Appreciate this, man. Right. Appreciate it. Thanks.